The Citadel football team is working hard this summer, not only in the weight room, but also in the community. We're out here helping, you know, Habitat for Humanity. Got some teammates out here helping someone build a house, helping wherever we can, digging some holes, drilling some holes, doing it all. About right here. Yeah. He went all the way down. For the third consecutive year, the Bulldogs lending a hand to Charleston's Habitat for Humanity, this year building houses on James Island. Great opportunity for our guys, tremendous experience, not only in what they do for the community, but uh, just growing as a football team closer together. I've got a number of jobs. I'm kind of a grunt man today. I've been doing a lot of shoveling. Uh, I've also been measuring just a little bit, but mostly grunting sand from one spot to another. Now for one Bulldog, some community service on a Saturday morning helping give a family their own front door and place to live hits a lot closer to home. I mean, I just remember when we first got our rooms and everybody was excited um, choosing what paint to paint the walls and just like little things like that. They go a long way. The nonprofit organization provided defensive back Sadat Jean Pierre and his family more than just a place to call home growing up in Immokalee, Florida. It gives you a brand new start, really. It's refreshing for people who might be in like small apartments and just different kind of scenarios in life. These affordable homes will be sold to qualified families at no profit with no interest charged. The Bulldogs helping fulfill the vision of a world where everyone has a decent place to live. And just like a Saturday in the fall at Johnson Hay Good Stadium, a building site no different, and there's always time for some football. I love being with these guys. We've got a great group of players. Everybody's excited about the 2013 season. We spend a lot of time here just getting on one another and uh, talking about the season and what they're doing and what they're not doing. Talk about seven on sevens in the summertime, so it is a fun time. Melissa Egan, CitadelSports.com.